Inflation, it does not arrive randomly. There are forces that cause inflation. Every time we've seen inflation in our history, there are forces that cause it. And in this case, we've had things that are outside of our control. And Democrats will argue uh, the president blames inflation on COVID-19, supply chain disruptions, Russia's invasion of Ukraine, the big bad oil and gas companies, uh, and other things. I don't know what the ne next thing is that he'll be blaming inflation on. Uh, but I agree, they certainly have played a role in causing inflation. However, those challenges are the same challenges that every other country across the world has faced. And they do not explain why inflation in the United States spiked earlier and is much worse than what we are seeing in other countries. This chart shows the annual core CPI inflation compared to uh, OECD, which is sort of peer countries, the Organization for Economic Cooperation and Development countries. And it shows how inflation spiked starting roughly the beginning of 2021 and far exceeded that of uh, comparable uh, countries. So what caused that? Well, I have another chart that puts a little finer point on this. And this shows that inflation started about the time that Biden took office and really acceler accelerated after the passing of the American Rescue Plan, which put trillions of dollars in spending uh, into our economy. Now, I showed that chart today in a hearing and budget to Mr. Stephen Moore of the Save America Coalition and he agreed that the clear difference between what we saw in the past chart, the blue line and the other countries, the clear difference was the stimulus that was provided, the, the increase in demand that was provided by inserting trillions of dollars into the U.S. economy uh, through the American Rescue Plan Act. And, and